Thanks for joining us today. Neighbors are working around the clock. They're clearing down trees, waiting on power to be restored and also assessing the destruction of some of their sidewalks. Eyewitness News reporter Anita O caught up with some of the homeowners who were impacted by this morning storms. I heard like waves crashing against the ceiling and I was really confused, but it was just the, the rain is coming down really hard. Those are the sounds that woke Aiden Wright up on Saturday morning. But when he looked outside, this street was just decimated. This street especially was just destroyed completely. It's 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 terrifying on Park Avenue off Dill Avenue in Collingswood. Entire trees uprooted, lifting even the sidewalk pavement with them. We're bummed. I loved that tree. Just one street over on Stokes Avenue, Josh Willie says it appears whatever passed through clipped just the tops of the trees outside of his home. It sounded like a plane going right over the house. Super loud. In other areas, trees and power lines littered the streets. We lost power. We have a couple of trees down. And though there's a lot to clean up, <laughs> neighbors are grateful. Uh, really, we got pretty lucky. Um, Nobody got hurt. The house only has a little damage. The National Weather Service issued a tornado warning on Saturday morning for some areas, including parts of New Jersey. But as far as what specifically blew through this area, causing all of this damage, that remains under investigation. Reporting in Collingswood, I'm Anita O, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.